Hello, I am Dr. Sriram. I am an ENT consultant working in Narayana Health Multi Specialty Hospital that's situated in Whitefield, Bangalore. Tonsil or lith? Now, tonsil or lith, as the name suggests, tonsil is tonsil and lith means stone. So, you have stones within the tonsils. Uh, how do these stones develop? Like any other stones in the body, most of them are calcium stones only. They are different uh, chemicals of calcium. Uh, the combination will be usually calcium oxalate or calcium carbonate, or sometimes even calcium hydroxyapatites. So, these stones develop whenever the tonsil scripts or the holes are big in size. They get colonized by bacteria, that is, the microorganisms. And the byproducts of these bacteria and also food secretions over a period of time they collect and they form these concretions these concretions and then later on called the tonsillar lith or tonsil stones most of the time tonsil stones are harmless they are just uh, an occasional examination by an ent doctor or a physician uh, can find you can make out that you have tonsil stones many times when the stones are big they can even be found out by an ultrasound or an x-ray in any case the tonsil stones are usually harmless but of course they can cause a lot of problems if they are big. Uh, you can have a foreign body sensation, you can have throat irritation, you can have halitosis. In any case, if you do have tonsillar lith or tonsil stones, or if you have a doubt that you have these, it's better to see any anti-doctor as soon as possible.